Window 11 requires TPM 2.0 enabled. The motherboard in this computer is a Geekbyte B550i and CPU is a AMD 4650G. Let me check the uh, TPM. Go to run and type TPM MSC. Okay, it says compatible TPM cannot be found. That means I know this motherboard supports the TPM. So that means that that's, that's TPM is disabled in the motherboard bias. So now we can sh shut down the PC and then re restart the uh, computer and hit the delete key. But there is another way to go into the BIOS. Go to the settings, update and uh, security, and recovery. Hit the restart now. The advanced setup, a uh, startup. Hit the restart now. Then, then, shoot. Advanced options. UEFI firmware settings. Restart. Now this is a BIOS settings. Go to. Some BIOS in some BIOS this uh, there are some uh, securities. That things in the securities, but uh, this one does not have securities. So I go to settings. Okay, that's the AMD CPU FTMP. That's the one I have to in, uh, enable. Enable F10 to save. Okay. Reboot. Okay, then check up TPM again. Run TPM.msc. In here, you see TPM version. Uh -oh. TPM version 2, right here. Okay, this is the Gigabyte B550i Eros Pro AX motherboard. Let's just check another motherboard. Okay, I start another uh, computer. That computer is a, a motherboard, is a Gigabyte H310MA2. Uh, this uh, CPU is a Intel i5-9400. Uh, uh, Same thing, check the uh, TPM first. Run T P M dot M S C It's same. See? It says compatible TPM cannot be found. Okay, now shut down and reboot. Restart. Restart. Hit delete key. Keep hitting delete key. Okay, this is my boy, the H310M A 2.0. Go to here. 
the first one is the Intel Platform Trust Technology, that one is PTT, that one must be on. So enable this one, move down to Trusted Computing, check this out. Okay, default is enabled, so that's, uh, this one is uh, all set. Go to the F10, say yes, and reboot the window now. Check it out, check it out, run tpm.msc. Yeah, see here, this one enabled, TPM version 2.0. Okay, this is the motherboard Gigabyte H310M A2. We go on for uh, the third one. Turn this off. Now, let's see the third computer. This uh, the motherboard of this computer is a MSI Z three ninety A Pro. CPU is a uh, Intel i nine ninety nine hundred K. Same uh, same thing. The first thing is to run TPM the MSC. Open it. I see. It's uh, not cannot be found. Okay, now go to the settings recovery restart now. Chop shoot advance. Restart. Reboot to the BIOS settings. In this BIOS, you see here there is a security. Click on here, trust computing. Circuit device support disabled. Enable. TPM device selection, the T PTT. F10 and say yes. Uh, run tpm.msc go. Okay, see here. That's uh, enabled. In this video, I have enabled TPM in these three motherboards. That's all for today. Thank you for watching.